About time, man. That took forever. The last vlog, yesterday's vlog, took forever to process and upload. Because it was kind of long, but what's good? How are you doing? I'm doing, you know, I don't feel great. Like, I'm not in the highest of spirits. It was earlier, but like, while I was waiting for the processing and stuff, I just kind of like, <sighs> got anxious out of nowhere. Like, it started to rise up. It hasn't like turn into an attack or anything like that, but just feeling anxious or whatever. But I'm going to the gym right now. Kind of don't want to. I do want to, but I mean like, I'm kind of like on the fence because of the way that I'm feeling right now. And this is what I was talking about like in the past when I used to say like, it, it keeps me from doing things I need to do. Um, speaking of anxiety, but I'm about to go anyways. I just got to get my mind right first. I got to get calm myself down. I got to shit. Sorry. I'm just a little messed up right now. But, 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 I'm gonna try my very best to not let this overtake me because I'm stronger than that. I could bench like 110. Like right now, how do I feel? I feel hot and I have the chills. My vision isn't like clear. My mind feels clouded. I'm like a little nervous slash like scared for no reason. Just like I'm, I don't, I'm not scared of anything right now, but it's just like, the feeling of being scared is just wants to come over me right now, but and it's like every time this happens, it feels like it's a new thing, but it's not. I mean, I've gone this is I've gone through it at least at least two thousand times. You know, every time it happens, it happens, and it's like what's going on here? I'm looking for my keys right now. So before I go to the gym, I'm probably gonna drive around before I get there, get my water first, hydrate myself. It could be like. I need water or something or in some type of vitamin, I don't know. I mean, I've been, I did the same routine as usual. Where are my keys? I'm about to freak out about that now. Just kidding. Starting today's vlog a little different than usual, but hey, it's 100% over here. We keep it real as it is. Where are my keys though, for real? Cause I know I came in and I put them right there. I'm tripping, they right here. That's right, cause I came upstairs and I went in there first. So not thinking straight, so. No one's here right now. Not even Daphne's here right now. But that camera's here. Yeah, all right. I have like really low energy right now. Um, almost as if like I could kind of like pass out. Like my body will just like give out for whatever reason, which I know it won't. But just when you allow that, those thoughts of like, oh, I'm about to die. When you like let that get into your head, that's when it starts to escalate. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. See, like right now, it um, I've never actually like filmed during like it happening kind of thing. But right now, like when I between clips, I got like super scared for no reason. Like out of nowhere, like I was, you know, it just all of a sudden I got light. I got super light. My senses like felt like they went out and then came back. Like we, I don't know. It's hard to explain unless you know what I'm talking about. Like if you've gone through it, then you know exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, that happened and then it felt like just everything went numb and then I started breathing and then I just felt my heart beat just boom, 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 which happens because I got scared and I got an adrenaline rush from thinking that something was about to happen because I went to the flight or fight mode. This is weird. I've never actually like done this in a vlog before, like actually like during the time and I'm just like praying that this isn't a bad, a bad one. Like I just wanted to end very soon. Like right now because I've had some really 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 bad ones like this is nothing compared to some of them that I've had I'm not gonna say it's gonna be one of them days but one of them them times right now where I gotta fight it off and I will do whatever I gotta do I just gotta go about this the right way got to get, 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 get the good vibes going well hello how you doing I'm leaving the gym right now I was initially supposed to do legs but the way that I was feeling I didn't think that would have been a smart idea friends don't let friends skip leg day I don't got no friends. I'm just kidding. But no, I went in and I just hit shoulders. Just blasted shoulders out real quick and did some calves. The whole anxiety thing, man, like I was inside, like before leading up to it, I was sitting outside, I was sitting out here for the longest, just like contemplating if I was gonna go in or not. And I was like, you know what? No, I'm not gonna let this control me. For years, This it disabled me from doing things that I wanted to do. I should be farther in life right now than I am but I've been held back from the anxiety and the panic attacks and stuff like that, which is, is fine because everything happens for, the re for a reason, I believe. Everything is perfect timing. Everything is right on time, happening in the, at the right time. But um, So I do feel better after that workout. During the workout, I was like, you know what? No, I'm not going to let this 
control me. You know, like I tell you guys, don't let nothing control you. Don't let nothing hold you back. Go after what you want to go after. And I can't tell you guys that and I'm not doing it. I'm not fighting, fighting it off. Like for some time I would just let it overcome me and I, was, I would just give up. But for a while now I've been fighting it. So, you know, I mean, like you see in the vlogs, I don't really deal with it as much anymore because I just, you know, but this came out of nowhere and I was like, you know what, fuck that, fuck this, I'm not, no, we're not going to do this shit, we're not going to do this. And the reason I'm so passionate about this is because, like, I really, really do want to help those of you that go through the same thing and, again, I'm passionate about it because it was such a, it's such a big factor in my life, I really feel like it fucked me up and it ruined my life for some time being, for the time being. You know, I don't really like saying it ruined my life because it made me who I am now. And, you know, I believe that I'm a stronger person. I have a different mindset on, uh, on things. And I'm very thankful for that. But I don't really know what I'm trying to say. When it comes to this topic, I get really scrambled up. Yeah, I don't know, man. But I, I'm sorry for the, the bad vibes starting off this vlog. We're not going to dwell on that. We're just going to move forward from here. It's going to be happy, good times. We're going to be, we're going to do it. We're going to do it. Yeah, yeah. Right now, sipping on this Quest Salted Caramel. The other new flavor that they came out with, the other one with banana cream. This one, I actually think I like this one more than the other one, which surprises me because I didn't think I would like it more. But, yeah. I'm about to shower and get changed and all that so we can go about the day. And I'll catch y'all in the next clip. Yes. Hello. I'm done. So. I'm just playing. What if I was a drug dealer like that, though? Hold on. Y'all sitting on top of a koala right now. I'm going to show you what you on top of right in a minute. You know I got to wear the watch that just got fixed. We got to bond, you know? We missed so much time together. Now we got to, you know, we got to catch up. This is what y'all was sitting on top of. Yeah. But, um, I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm watching boxing right now. I'm ready, waiting for the uh, Broner fight to come on. So until then, I'm going to just be hungry to the end of that, which is, oh, this going to suck. Hopefully this dude, somebody get knocked out right now, and then uh, we watch the Broner Porter. What did I just say? Broner Porter. Yeah, Spence, which is the black dude, he was messing him up, bro. This is the second round. He was jacking him up. <laughs> I'm trying to find something to eat in the meantime before I go out or leave. Yep, we ain't got nothing. The Browner Porter's on now, and <laughs> I'm tired, man. But Browner lost. <laughs> That's now why I'm uh, smiling. Yo, Kev is really a married man now. You married. Like, officially married, man. That's why I'm smiling right now. I've seen it on Instagram right now. I was like, man. My cutty Oh! Hey, man, but for real, I can't believe you ended your life like that, man. Your life is over. <laughs> I'm kidding. You know I'm kidding. I just got to say that I'm kidding for some of the viewers. Because some of the viewers be like, is he serious? Or, you know how that go. But, yeah, bro. Really... From the bottom of the honesty pit of my heart, bro, because I got one of those in my heart. I got a little honesty pit. But that's where this is coming from right here. Watch. Congratulations to you and yours, man. To you and Marie and your family as a whole, man. It's a beautiful thing that you guys got going on over there. Man, I uh, I wish you guys nothing but the best, man. Nothing but the blessed. You know what I mean? I hope you have a, a great wedding night. I know it's already gone, but like this whole wedding week wedding month man enjoy it enjoy the rest of your life man always keep god first and your family's gonna be straight um it's gonna be a lot there's gonna be trials and tribulations and uh, ups and downs but you just gotta you just gotta push through it man you always gotta remember man that's that's the love of your life man look at me talking like i ever had a girlfriend i ain't never even had i ain't never had a date before like once bro all right you can send me that uh like 20 dollars to my paypal now for that little shout out Wanna tell you how beautiful you are, but you know where to be found. I'm in Target right now. Uh, you know I'll be in Target. I ain't got the black shirt on today, but I'm having. On the low, I'm gonna tell them to meet me in the back and give me like a 20 pack of their hands. I'm just playing. 
So he from uh, North Carolina, supposedly. Yeah, supposedly. <laughs> he knows J. Cole, so I was like, hey, I was playing, I know him. Dream big. Target. Yeah, man. I'm so hungry, though. I can't. I'm not really hungry, though. I just know that I need to eat because I ain't ate nothing hey, since. Uh, hey, man, you should go to the Waffle House. Uh, right now? Oh, wait. We ain't got a Waffle House right now. West Coast. <laughs> West Coast. You're supposed to be working, bro. Come on. All right, 